for the first time since he was released from jail. We're hearing this morning from James Ray. He's the self-help guru charged in connection with the deaths of three of his followers at a sweat lodge in Arizona. As our Mike Von Fremd reports, Ray says he's a humbled man, but he still wants to help his people. Prosecutors say what happened in this Sedona sweat lodge in October was not an accident. It was manslaughter. Two people are breathing. There was no pulse. This self-help guru could go to prison for more than 30 years. His trial begins in August, but Ray is already trying to reach new followers through the Internet. You might also be aware that I don't have a company any longer, and so I'm going to ask you to join me here. Via the internet. He also set up a Twitter account. Andrea Puckett lost her mother in the sweat lodge. She says she's upset Ray continues to try to spread his message. You know, he's got every right to do it. Is it the right thing for him to do? No. If he truly felt bad about what's happened here and respected the families and people that he's affected, he would just keep quiet during this time. Many are anxious to see if he will rise yet again and become an internet phenomenon or write yet another nationwide bestseller. I have a wealth of information still inside of me. This self-professed spiritual warrior continues to work hard to try to get his message out. For Good Morning America, Mike Bonfram, ABC News.